whole rise. You may be seated. Thank you, Honorable Judge. Yes, Bona Bailey, how are yes, you doing? I'm fine. Good. Hope you're doing well. As Thanks always. To God. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Honorable Judge. Today we are in the, uh, this case is case number 119513151. Yes. Whereby it's a marriage dissolution, Honorable Judge. So we have Hannah Tarus. May you come forward? She's the plaintiff, Honorable Judge. Yes. And uh, Joshua Tarus. Come forward. He's the defendant. Thank you, Honorable Judge. Hannah here is accusing Joshua uh, of neglecting her as a wife. She is blaming Joshua for asking her to stop working so that she can become a housewife. Now he wants her to keep on begging him for everything. He wants her to kneel to him so that he may support her. And that's all, Honorable Judge. Good, good, good. Thank you, Bailiff. Good, Miss Anna. Kindly introduce yourself by telling us who you are, what you do, your education standards, your profession, if you have any, or what you do. How, or what, how do you build the nation? As, how do you be part, be part of this good nation, beautiful nation? Yes, Your Honor. I'm uh, Hannah, uh, a business lady. Are you into business? Yes. Okay. Madam, you're Hannah who? I'm Hannah Kimenden, Your Honor. Anna Kimende. Yes. Well, when the profile was being read, when you're being introduced, your name was different. It was yes, she's Anna Tarus. I'm dissolving this marriage. Oh, you're dissolving. And I don't want this man is okay, a fine. hell. No, okay, fine, fine, fine. Madam. I understand. Order, 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 Mr. Joshua. So it's okay you're dissolving this marriage, and you really don't want to have to have any relation with him. But at the moment, you use the name which you are introduced with. Exactly. Anyway, it's okay. Who happens to be the Kimende? Kimende is my father. Oh, that's your father's name? Yes. Okay. But for today, you prefer to be called so why Miss Kimende. Order! <laughs> you prefer to be called a Miss Kimende? Yes. Okay. Please don't get so jumpy at an early point like this. Yeah. It's not even heated up. So please, I'm hold sorry, it, hold Honor. it. We are still introducing ourselves. You think I'm going to need Order, to order, 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 please. I'm, I'm I didn't not tell going him. to need Order. I didn't tell him to keep quiet so he may get to shout back at him. Please, let's have a orderly session. Yeah, so Ms. K Ms. Kimende, you wish to be called Ms. Kimende, I understand. Not Ms. Mr. Star Rus. Order, order. Please, she chose to be called Ms. Kimende. Let's, uh, let's leave it at that. It's her choice. Her name, it's her choice. It's their reference. It doesn't matter much. Mm -hmm. Yes, Ms. Kimende, tell me more about yourself. Your education standards. I'm a degree holder. What? You're a degree. Yes. Order. <laughs> Order. You'll, the, you'll have your time. I know where I found this letter. Uh, you'll have your Order. time to oppose all that. For now, just hold it. Let us go speak. by you. I will never go speak. by you. It's high time. Order, you order, order. It's you high time. Order, please. Order. Sorry. Order. please. Order. Let's order. not make this order. a marketplace. Yes. Sorry, Your Honor. Let it be the last time I hear your story because I really want to have done with these. I got other things to attend to. So yes, Miss Kimende, so you see you're a degree older, your husband tends to kind of oppose that. He feels you're uh, like not telling the truth. What degree do you hold and where did you go to school? Which college, university did uh -huh. you go to? I went to St. Paul's. Oh, St. Paul's yes. University. That is in Limuru or somewhere. Yes, I did business management. Matter. Okay, okay. And what, uh, what did you do? Business management. Business management. <laughs> and what business do you do? I, I had salon. You I had? had a, yes, I had okay. a salon. Yes. I had a car wash. Then what okay. happened? Okay, okay, order. My friend. Oh, goodness. Let me the last this time I'm asking you to be okay. to be content and holding it. Yes. I had a car wash, a I car had wash. a salon, I had a restaurant. Okay. And what happened? Because it's all in the past. Uh, Before is... this man persuaded me to become a housewife with his sweet, sweet talks. He told oh, me to come he, back he to... talked yes. you to be a She fall in love, Your Honor. Did I ask Do you, you call to it speak? That love? Please. Do you even call Wait, it order, love? order. Oh, please. You know what? I'll throw this case out and you can go dissolve it or divorce or remarry wherever you will be going. I don't have time for this nonsense. Let's focus and keep it real. So, you had a business and this man talked to you out of your business to become a housewife. Yes, Your Honor. Who does that? Order, please. Was it by force or you chose to? Mm -hmm. 
as we were a couple. You are we were married. You fall in we love. Had... Uh -huh. Oh, excuse me. Omera. Mm -hmm. We had a, a little boy together. We are married, legally married. Yes. That is why we, we want to dissolve this in court. We are married, so I listened to him as the oh, head of he the house. Oh, he kind of used the baby, take care of the baby instead of running yes. the business. And you were happy with the, with, the, with the advice or choice because you thought you will be, be a better mother to your child and he brings enough bread at home. Yes, Your Honor. Okay, fine. We can hold it there with you. Mr. Joshua, yes, you are really Honor. burning to speak. Mm -hmm. The floor is yours. Talk to me. My name is Joshua Tarus. Yes, Mr. A businessman. A businessman. Handsome. Arrogant. And rich. Uh, well, we, it is not a handsome or a beauty contest. We came here for this is, a, this is a justice contest. We just came here to find the truth of the matter. So yeah. please, uh, if you think you are handsome, I'm sorry. I don't know. It is it's not for me to know. So I, I, that's now my interest. Uh, I so can please, defend let's that. Let's keep by... focus. Let's okay. talk. Uh, let's bring the matter to what it matters. Okay. So everything this lady is saying. Yes. Okay. Tell us about yourself before you start talking about what oh, the lady yeah. said. I'm a businessman. I do my businesses. I'm running a technology, telephone network company oh. in Kenya and outside Kenya. What do you say? A that telephone is in technology or tele telephone mobile? network company. Yes. So are you one like a uh, safari call? Exactly. That's well, a what's the name of your company? Oh, uh, it's called Juzi Network. Tell the truth. Uh, Juicy Network, it's coming up. We are oh, opening businesses up. in Europe, Asia, and everywhere, outside the country. Tell the truth what you do. Madam Hannah, you have nothing. Tell you the truth what you do. You know nothing. Order, 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 please. Uh, as you're talking here, Illegal mm. this lady, she is doing too much of nonsense. Wait, wait a minute, please, please. I uh, have something to say. Please, when, when, you, when you say that, you have to substantiate it because we don't use such a language in this court. Mm -hmm. So uh, please don't, 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 don't make it fall so hard on you because okay, I that's never, a very rude language. I never forced her to come in my house, though we got married. Oh, nobody forces the, uh, the other to the marriage. Marriage is by choice. So yes, you so she chose her. She, cho she chose me, I'm and you chose her. No, I'm tired how, of how this man. I'm you just tired somebody. of you. I did. not How did you end up marrying someone? I'm a handsome man. I have many order, ladies order, outside order, here. Order, please, if you talk about your looks again, we're gonna be having a problem. Your please, Honor, don't you order. When I speak, you listen. If you use your looks or talk about your looks here, you'll tell me whether this is a looks competition or is a justice place? I've told you your looks matters to you and whoever you will be talking to, but for me, at the moment, I want to hear you tell nothing but the truth and let me try to see whether we can throw out some justice, okay? Okay. So you, if you talk about your looks, this is a warning, and okay. it's right, okay. right, it's for real. So okay. please don't tell me about your looks. So your honor, let this lady be quiet from order, now. Order, order, please. Why, why am I having a problem with you, Mr. Taurus? Who's laughing? Oh, hey. Can you shut up? People, please. Anna, you should understand. You're making it difficult for me. Order. Please, please. Sorry, Judge. Your Honor, where I come from, ladies are not allowed I'm to I'm asking speak. for a recess. All right. Order. Don't make it impossible for me. All rise. Oh, you may be seated. Kindly let's have him back. Okay, Honorable Judge. I hope you'll be orderly and uh, be ready to continue with the proceedings. Okay. Kindly, Mr. Taras, tell us about yourself and in a more mature manner, like okay. you understand where you are. Don't My... forget you're accused and you're under oath. Please respect the court. 
My name is Joshua Taras. Yes, sir. I'm a businessman. Okay. Mm -hmm. I work and in... And you said what business did you say you do? A telephone network company. Telephone network company. Yeah. So it's not that you're selling a particular brand. It's like you were doing something to do with the network. Yes. And uh, you're planning to open a network or you're trying to help or you're maintaining networks? We are, we are trying to open a met, uh, network, a new network. And it's registered with the Ministry of exactly. Communication and yeah, Telecommunication yeah. and yes. stuff. Yes. Okay. Good. What's the name of your company? It's called Mjuzi Network. Okay. Yeah. You have any foreigners involved or it's all local? Yeah, we have foreigners involved. And as for now, uh, we are working in Africa and Europe. Oh, so it's an European? Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Fine. Good. And uh, so that means sometimes you happen to travel out of exactly. the country? Exactly. Most of the times I'm not around. Why um, you say most of the times? You travel. You I'm, yeah, I'm a very busy man. Okay. Yeah. Good to be busy. And uh, Madam Hannah here is your wife. Yeah. Yes. You married? You married in church or yeah, yeah, in yeah. the authority? We, we, with the authority there? With the it was Shiria. a wedding. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, we got many presents from friends and. Oh. Yeah. That means, once upon a time you were in love. Yeah. A yeah. monster. Okay. You were in love. Just a monster. And. Uh, Miss Anna, what are you murmuring? Can't you wait for your moment? Then, then you have it. But that let it not be a tradition that you murmur for me to give you a moment. Please kindly tell, 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 tell me what happened because you, you, it looks like you can't wait. What happened that things went south? How long have you been married, by the way? Eight years. Eight years? Yes. And uh, how many kids? One. One? Yes. A boy or a girl? A boy. What's her name? Ivan. Hmm? Ivan. Ivan. Yes. Ivan or Ivan? Ivan Tarus. Ivan. Oh. Ivan Tarus. Oh. Okay. Okay, Ivan Tauris. How old is he? Six years. Six years? Yes. Okay. Good. We are getting some in. And uh, so how come after six years you're thinking of dissolving this marriage? And what is the reason? After this man is just a monster in the making. Not a monster in the making, a real monster. Well, uh, yeah, can you tell me? I, I'd order, rather order, please, order, please. Order, 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 Miss Anna. Uh, tell us when the monster started germinating because I thought at one time you married because he was all sweet and all love. Tell me what happened and at what point. How many, after how many years did you start seeing the monster and how did it come to be a monster? Three years ago. Three years ago. Yes. The monster came home instead of your husband. Yes. Uh, by which order? How, what happened? Once he came home with a girl. A, no, a tell me how lady. it started. Did it start by way of abuse, insults? Or yes. their fight because bringing a girl, I think those are the those are like uh, you know top, so uh, the uh, part of the top like this is over. You don't start. You don't just come with a girl. Some uh, something started somewhere. Maybe an argument or something. After mm -hmm. making me sell all my uh, businesses and staying at home, taking the matters of the home, that is when all this started. Order, order, Ms. Atiras. You'll have order. a moment to, to explain all that. So when you say after he pushed or convinced you to dissolve or to sell your businesses, how old were the businesses? Were you, were you running the businesses? Did you have the businesses prior to marrying him? Or did you, did you do the Did you build the, or get the business together? I had the businesses. My dad was rich. My dad was wealthy. My family was wealthy. So I, I had the businesses before we got married. Oh, so the businesses were sorely yours? Yes. Okay. Yeah. But he convinced you to sell them? Yes, Your Honor. He convinced me to sell them with the, his talks, as the, his looks, his talks, and then we were in love. So I saw it better to take the matters of the home as a good woman. Okay. Yeah, so he convinced you to sell your businesses. So I came home. Yes. And what happened to the money that you sold your businesses? Did he reinvest or what happened? 
he took it in that name of that company of her of his which i don't even know i'm hearing now is what what did you say the name was i don't even remember he never speaks to me about anything he does after you sold your company uh, companies or your business how long did it take before things started changing i took almost six months did you have a joint account for you to say that you, he took all the money? Did you deposit in the same account or he convinced you to deposit in his account? I just gave him the money. He, I deposited all the money in his name. As a good wife I was. As a humble, very good wife. As a good wife you were. So you are no longer the good wife. Now I, I, I'm dissolving this marriage. That's why I'm talking like this. No, you, might be, you, you might be dissolving the marriage but you're still a good person. I'm a good person but not to him. Okay. Mr. Torres, I see you making faces, gestures of disagreement. Kindly tell this court, why do you disagree? disagree? Which part of this do you disagree? The businesses belong to your, to your yeah, wife and yeah. you convinced her to sell them and she gave you the money. Uh, the first point I disagree with is me convincing her to sell her businesses. So you didn't the convince The businesses her. belong to their family. Belonged to their family. To their family. Yes. She was the only girl. She was the only kid. Not educated. Oh, only girl or only kid? Only kid. Excuse okay. me, I'm No education. Okay. No education, no <laughs> nothing. Who didn't they have education? Her. I thought you said, she said she went to oh university. She's lying. Yes. she's lying. She's lying. What? She's I'm lying. I'm under oath. I'm not lying. Ma you are ma Miss Anna, Miss Anna, please understand this. And also to you, Mr. Taurus. If you, if you really push that thing about the university, that you can agree that you married somebody who don't even know her education standards, because you say your wife is not that learned, and she says she's a university girl, a lady, material, whatever, and uh, she's a graduate, let me put it that way. Mm -hmm. You know, I can just put this, I can post this case to another date, and if she comes with those certificates, since you're under oath, you'll tell me why you, didn't, you married a woman you don't, you let don't know. Let and for you, if you don't bring that certificate, it will be a problem to your, in your court. I have proof, Your Honor. I'm okay. learned. Fine, fine, fine. That. Well, okay. let, me, let me put it this way. Uh, since we came here about uh, dysfunctional marriage, let's just keep it to the marriage. Education, uh, let, us, uh, let us leave it at that. But you said the business was hers. Business was hers. But you convinced her to sell it. It was not making profits. Oh my really? And therefore... You advise her to sell it so she can help you build your bigger... She was not helping me. My businesses were doing great. But I've she told you that she gave you the money. You are she decided to give me the money because so, she is okay, not working on what, anymore. On, on what grounds? Did she invest in your company? Did she buy shares or her, what do you mean? She, she didn't gave? buy shares. She's not a partner. She's just a wife and I decided to help her. Really? And, but you took the money from... I you, took the money, yes. You took the money? Yes. You see how Okay, so you agree is? you took the money? I took the money. What was the total money? What was the figure? Mm, the business, were, they were not doing that well and we I sold I asked for them. the figure, how good they were doing. We'll get to know. I understand there was a restaurant. What and what? And what? How much was and it cow that wash. you gave him? A restaurant, a car wash, a car wash. and a salon. Okay. I gave him okay. 1.2. 1.2 million. Yes. Okay. Cash. 1.2 million was deposited in your account okay and i remember very well. i see he's not he's not arguing that so i think that one that one passes yeah that is good okay you gave him 1.2 million yes okay and uh mr torres you're good with what you've said yeah 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 okay, okay let's come back to you the complainant so yes so you did you did give him the money and uh yeah, so uh, to keep, uh, keep telling us how, how the monster came to be. Yes, yeah, so after being at home as yes. a good wife. For how long? After six, six months being at home. For six yes. months so he was good. Now you've sold your business. Yeah, I sold my business. You've given him the money. Yes. Now I'm and, at uh, home. And you gave him the money as a good wife. Yes. He, there's no contract, no understanding that uh, he's buying shares. You're buying shares in his company. Nothing like Nothing. that. Nothing. So you gave him as a family. Yes. Yeah. Okay, makes sense. So I was in the house, mm. doing house chores, taking the matters of the home. Yes, like, taking uh, care of your son. Be... Yeah. Yes. How old is your son by this time? My son is... Uh... Not, not now, at this time that you're selling your yeah. business to come and be at our housewife. My son was three years old. Three years old? Yes. Okay, yes. okay. So he's not even started baby class? Yes. Still your family? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you seen what that is as a man? You don't get my baby class. Yeah, you don't get my baby class. Oh, <laughs> 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 but uh, 
anakula kutoka kwa mama. Okay, yeah, uh, yes, keep talking. So I stayed at home. Yes. And I was taking care of the home matters. Okay. And when he became it, violent it, now. How? He, he can't just go and come back violent. Uh, there he must be something. He started drinking. Oh, he started drinking. Yes. He was not drinking before that. He was that. not drinking before that. Oh, he, when did, he, he did married, drink, but not abusively. He never used to drink. He never used to you drink. You see, even our church wedding, which we were at church, he's a church guy. Oh, he's he's a good guy. He's still a church guy, or he stopped going to church? He stopped going to church. Oh, he, he was drinking. a church guy. Yeah, he was a church guy. Uh -huh. He stopped going to church. Yes. He started drinking. Okay. Coming home drunk. Okay. Beating the hell out of me for no reason at all. Well, when you say beating the hell out of you, did he, was he violent with all, everybody or just you as a person? Just me. Just as you person. as a person. Yes. And there must have been something wrong. Me, you are you are you, you see Vita Pombe. Yeah. Vita Pombe, I think if you, if you are told mm. you mm. you just fight everybody. Exactly. Ananza na ba. Ananza na ba. Na watchman wa ba ama na ba. Na pega mudu mumbai sana. Yeah. Okay. Rojo, when na jo mli some is mli mume koko kofi na jo mambo. You are honoring me. So what? What order? Order. And after the kwanu na fikiri alikuja kupuleta vita jumbani. There must have been something yeah, happening. There must have been something wrong. Kula shida. Yeah, exactly. Eh, what you to skize? Yes. Speak. What pains me? Mm. This all this beating and caning. He does it in front caning? of me. Yes. He cans me like a baby, like a kid, like his own kid. What am I Madam, madam, I don't get any body mass. How does he get to nail your baka? I could pick a biboko. Men are yeah. men, they are strong. They are strong. Yes, like this guy, you, you can see him like this, but very strong. Strong where? Anda. A fandi. Eh? Or you any one of the people that I'm one of Kiria is strong where? Young, like any. Mama na sema na umo na so he does that before my own So well, how does he beat? He tells you lie down and can you bring your hand? I can. He ruffled you? me and tie me on the bed. What? With canes or sometimes with the bed. Mr. Torres, you can not call a pinga yo. Is it? Are you not agreeing with that? This is a monster. I'm telling you, Ahona. Stop calling me. Oh, oh, order, 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 please, Mr. Torres. Uh, first of all, finish explaining. I'll give you a moment to explain yourself too. So. Uh, uh, Madam Anna, so he ties you to the bed and beats you. Yes. In the presence and in the eyes of your son. Yes, your, your son watches you being beaten. Yes, your honor. And if he tries order, to order say... Corridor, order corridor. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yes. And in that moment, when, this, when my son comes and tells him, Daddy, don't do it, he beats the son. The violence you see, is extended no, to the child. extended to the child. But the Mr. maid Matoras, and the shamba boy are say. very, he's very good to the employers. Very good, very nice. To the employees? Yes, it's just me. What's wrong with you? Look at you. Mr. Don't, Torres. Today you, you must the, say the truth. Anna, stop it. Order, today, order, 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 please. Order, order. Truth. Mr. Torres, I want to hear from you. Kindly respond to that. How do you become a monster to the woman you chose to marry? You said, you told her you love her till death do her part. You have a child together. And even because you extend the violence to your child who is quite innocent, just because he tells you don't hit my mommy. What's your going honor, on? I'm a very busy man. I come home very late. And because you are late, you think you beating her will rewind no. hours? As businessmen outside here, we meet many people. Yes. As men. Where are you going with this? Also, when you meet so many people, you reduce them in we your, meet in your brain by beating them. Wait, I'm continuing with my point, sir. We meet beautiful ladies. When I come home, Madam Hannah here takes 10 minutes or more to open the door. Really? Really? I eat cold food. You eat cold food? You are under oath. You are under oath. You are under oath. Order, 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 Bisana. She, he's under oath, and that's good you mentioned, but it was me to say that's that. That's a lie. Oh. Hey. Order, please. Let's not recess this uh, this case. We, we we are getting somewhere. Let's not recess it because of interruption, which doesn't make sense. Sorry. So, and I ask her, why why don't you warm the food or why don't you open the door for me? I, I see people. Where are you? You are living in a modern life. There is a microwave. Yes. You can't warm your husband's food, and why? If he can't, couldn't you do it yourself? I'm 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 tired, sir. I'm I'm from business. From you're tired to warm your food, but you are not tired to eat. 
Okay, why don't she do it for me? She's my why wife. Why does she have to do it for you? And I ask her, why, why don't you warm the food? Or why don't you open the door for me? I, I see people, where are you, you are living in a modern life. There's a microwave. Yes. You can't warm your husband's food. And why? If he can't, couldn't you do it yourself? I'm, I'm, I'm tired, sir. I'm, I'm from business, from... You're tired to warm your food, but you're not tired to eat. Okay, why don't she do it for me? She's my why wife. Why does she have to do it for you? She's my wife. Your wife is not your slave, neither your servant. You have even workers. Okay, I have workers. They do it, but I come home late. Who do I expect to open the door you for don't me? don't even come home sometimes. I'm busy, man. I'm a businessman. What work are you I'm doing? I'm very oh, busy. Oh, Miss Anna, please. You know? Oh, Miss Anna, so I, I think sorry. you enjoyed your moment. You didn't even interrupt. So don't be the one not to spoil things. So, so the violence comes from you've come late, you've seen beautiful ladies outside there, and when you come home, but don't you think your wife is beautiful as well? Okay. What do you mean beautiful ladies? When I don't, you say beautiful, I, I don't I want to understand why you, 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 there was that reference of beautiful ladies. Okay, the beautiful ladies want me. Anyway, that's, 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 let's leave that alone. We are here or talking no, about... No, 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 no. Don't leave it alone because I, I want to see now yes. what you're losing is what we call wisdom. Because if you chose her and told her she's the woman in your life, even if the angels were to come down, she should still be the most beautiful woman in your life. I go to big businesses with prominent it, it, people. It doesn't matter. I, and you go to my appearance big... there makes a lot of sense. And therefore, I need to have people around me who are very well, okay, with good faces and so, presentable. But why did you tie her down by marrying her and she holds it like you're the husband? She was beautiful. She started. She stopped applying those things just because she's staying at home. Because you are not Look helping at her. me. But order, order, order. What do you mean she start? She stopped applying those things. When you say those things, you mean the makeups and exactly. all the grooming herself. Exactly. But you stopped her from going. Do you give her any allowances to upkeep herself? Yes. Okay. She doesn't ask for money because really? she's staying at home. You know, uh, you as a man, it doesn't pass through your mind. My wife needs to look good. She needs to dress good, and uh, I need to uh, to supply as that. As I've told you, Your Honor, I'm a busy man. Oh, you're busy I have to me. supply, but you want the services. Okay. You're not a busy man. You're a selfish man. That's what I'm I would not. call you. Yes, because my oh, why, why do you want to come home <laughs> and drink a glass of yes. milk, but you don't want to know where the I kettle was fed? Uh, the cow was fed. Okay, for, for food, food, I give, my workers always do that. They ask me, they say, then, ah, we your are workers, not, exactly. She you, doesn't you, do that. You give the, your workers the money to buy and shop things. She doesn't do that. But you, you want her to do the donkey part of the work for warming your food and all that, and going out with the beautiful woman, but she's the one to stay home as your wife. If she could have asked for those things, I will it's provide. It's a matter of common sense, my son. Yes. It's a matter of common sense. As a man, you don't need to be told. But I'm a she's your man. wife. She, you, that's where you become a man. You, you man up. She, order. You should have done this for yourself at home. You didn't have to get me here. I'm being, I'm being paid by the government to do the thing, what you're trying to do for me. Watch your, watch your mouth. So, check this out. Manning up is knowing your responsibilities. You don't have, she doesn't have to tell you. So, if your son today, God forbid, happens to be in hospital for a reason, or is, okay, let's even put it on the positive side, he's, he's graduating, you have to be called, kuja shule. Or you, it's automatic for you as a man, my son is graduating, let me go to the, you know, I'm, let me see as, him. As I've said, I'm a, I'm a very busy man. So, uh, so for, you, thing, for, you, for you, it's about being busy and making money. Exactly. So, okay, that gives me a reason see? maybe why I should give, I should give you, I grant you people divorce and I give a full custody of the child. So you can make all no. your money yes. and uh, you don't have to have other yes. concerns or holdbacks. <laughs> like a wife at Anna, home. stop it. Yes. Order, order, Anna, order, Anna, please. please don't yeah. rub the salt. Anyway, she's Miss Kimende. She's Miss Kimende? Yeah. What do you mean she's a Miss Kimende? <laughs> what yes, do you mean you know, by Miss Kimende? You know, eh. Eh, the way she talks. Eh. Oh, oh, Kimende, and a big one. Yeah. Okay. Eh, eh, eh. I found the other order. I found the other insert to continue. Exactly. Mm. Yes, so, uh, Mr. Torres. So I come home. The food does not No, no, did we finish with that? Do you, do you see your way you're failing as a husband and as a man? As a man? I, I don't think if I'm failing because I'm working you very say, hard. Uh, no, it's not about working hard. It's also meeting your responsibility. It's not about working. Maybe you're working hard, you need to work smart. Yes. Okay, with someone who is shouting at you. Well, I don't think he shouts at you at home because I she think you've already intimidated me. her. 
mtu dafu unapaka kwa kitendo unapiga viboko i've never done that are you sure I yes told you you were under well that one happened when you were just between the two of you but but you accept you hit her once in a while don't you no she shouts at me and, and i and you need, get back at her uh, women in our community don't point what community is this <laughs> We Where are living as human from? beings. We don't live as a community anymore. <laughs> Those community laws are way gone and traditions. Okay. Not Where I come from, women are not standards. even allowed to shout at a man. So you are the kind of people even who don't want to take their girls to school because tradition doesn't allow. No, I'll mm. take my kids to school, mm. but they should not shout. As a woman, don't. She so if, your do if you have a daughter today and she argues with, her, with your son, and the truth is your daughter is, re is right to her argument, and your son is, uh, is wrong, so you'll tell your daughter to keep quiet and listen to the wrong man because she's no, not supposed to talk. She's, she, you can say the, the, the right things at the right, uh, the right way. You don't have to shout. You see, some, saying it right way is according to my standards. I'll choose how it's said. Okay? Maybe even I'm not liking the way you're talking to me, but to you, you think we are, we are communicating. Okay. It's my standard and my choice. Right, but to our, where I come from, women, as I was, how, how I was brought... Okay, okay. You said you're a modern man flying out of this country exactly. and, and off. I thought you were polished and... Uh, like you're enlightened and well, knows how the world is going and you should give your wife that kind of right and standards yes. of life, you know? As a lady, she's an educated yes. woman, she's the mother of your yes. child. I thought you would uh, respect her enough not to tell her to keep quiet and her place yeah. is in the kitchen. So, as a busy man, you want your wife to be your, your slave. So when you come home, he nurses you, she nurses you, give you warm your food, open the door like the king is here. The, the thing is, she doesn't know the roles of a wife. But you put still, it that oh, wait a minute. But maybe she was good with the roles of her, of her business. But you pushed her after three years of marriage to quit her business to come and be a good wife. I didn't push her. Maybe she was just too much of a good wife. That's how come I you didn't are happy push her and you feel you've nailed her. No, I, I, Order. I, I, I'm, I'm done with you for with that part. Yes, Miss Anna, tell me uh, something else. Bring, another, uh, bring honor, forth another he's complaint. He's not even getting your point. You are telling him uh, something order, he's order, not Order, order, Miss Anna, I didn't ask point. you. I told you to bring forth another complaint. I didn't ask you whether he's getting or not. Yes, Your Honor. He's brought up something that I don't ask for money. I don't ask for anything. He gives the workers money to do shopping for me. Why? Once he found me, I went to, he came home, I was in the marketplace. When I came back, he beat me up. He caned me. Until I begged for my dear life. Oh, mama, my Just mama, because I, I went to the market. So I told him I will not, never, never, ever go to the market again. Oh, okay, 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 oh, okay. Wait a minute. Okay, La, you, didn't, you didn't get me right. I didn't get this right. I found it. I found it. Oh, Rumi, Mama, Wally. Anyway, uh, you know, for me, I really hate when I dissolve families. I hate seeing people who have taken vows that they belong and uh, they have to break at a point. But uh, before we get there, let's just get to understand how it is. Order, order, please. I don't want to recess this case again. Let's go it through. You went to the market. Yes. Sir. What kind of a market? Grocery market, clothes market. What kind of a market was it? General market. I was General going market. To the and now, uh, and he came back and he didn't find you. He didn't. When find you me. came back, when you came back, hell had broken loose. Yes. What time was it? It was around three p.m. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. And that is after him taking a whole month. Not to be seen in the house. I didn't know where he was. It he was not, traveling. It, uh, you see, you see, this where. is where we go wrong. Europe. Yeah. Order, order, order. This is where we go wrong, eh, Afandi? Yes. Because you've done wrong as a spouse, you know, yeah. me and my wife. I, she gone out for a drink. Yes. You know, competition. <laughs> this is where we go wrong. And I hope you didn't go out because he had gone for a month. I don't but drink but uh, but uh, you don't why why would you deny your wife to I go don't. to the market yes are you suffering from any kind of insecurity no why, and why would you beat her because she went to the market i didn't he's, he's so insecure she has just said i don't give her money where did she I, get I the get money in, from you don't get insecure with the person you don't love I where did she get the money them, from or you to love go them to so the much grocery. you feel like they would be taken away from you i don't no, call where, that where did she get the money i can't tell that is grocery that is his, because you are, not, you, are not give her give her you, do, you are not given her any money. Now, where did she get the money from? He gives workers. 
Yeah, so you the got money. the money from so, the so workers? So I got the money from the, our maid, and I told her, today, let me just go out for a while. Let me go and shop for myself. You see? I don't even that give the money. That is how I got the money. He doesn't give. If he gives, he gives 400 shillings. And they have begged and even knelt down. Today I'm not kneeling down for you. Oh, wait, wait, Stop wait. Order, order, Anna. order, please, please. Stop Can it. you order? Order, please. Order, please, order, please, order, please, please. Let, let's, let's, observe, let's observe some order. Please, anybody who wants to talk to the other, please talk through me. Yes. Please, let's not have a direct conversation in between you. So, if you... What about your personal supplies? Yeah, maybe. Who takes... How, or do you mean 400 shillings are enough for your supplies and you're catering for your personal? Your honor, that is so sad. He doesn't give me a dime. This man you see here, these are so-called handsome, going to Europe. I don't know where. I don't even see, think his businesses are legal. What are you trying this to do? Man here, wait, wait, you know, wait, wait. You didn't answer me. I'm asking you how you get, uh, you get to do your things, how you get yourself through I life find with my, all your needs. I find old T-shirts and do the, the old, old hey, towels God in forbid, the house. God forbid. Don't see, tell anymore. I quit. Hey, okay. Yeah, that is... How this man has brought me to With a husband who's traveling all over the world doing A billionaire. <laughs> and even can't take care of me and my, his, my little boy. And how does he treat the son? Sometimes he's good. You know, the characters of this man, I can't tell. Oh, he's Today got... is good. To you the, the other boy? Day, or never to you? Never to me, to the boy. But no, not to the boy. One time, one moment, is an angel. The other is a monster. Now, I, I, I fail to understand him. That's why I don't want this marriage. I'd rather stay in the I'm okay streets. with it. Let us dissolve the marriage. You can go wherever. Oh, I'm okay. No, 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 no. Once you get married, and uh, this, this is the problem, <laughs> haven't yes, yes. Ah, no. Uh, this is the problem, order. You see, once you've been with each other, and you commit, and you call in a witness, yes. okay? The fourth witness is the government. Should you have been just a boyfriend and girlfriend, you would not have come here. But since you, have, you hold a certificate saying that you are married, if today you pass on, pass away, she is entitled to everything. If today she passes on, you are entitled to burying her and you're entitled to all she has. Because of that paper, you, call, you say, just say, let's dissolve it. Even if you say dissolve it, I'll, I'll, my, my, you, you, that's why you see we don't just give divorce. We don't just dissolve marriages. That's why you have to explain. We, have, we, have, we as a state have to, understand, have to understand why is this contract coming to an end. Of course, I will the Denia Bank bond. I'm getting you, Your Honor. So, don't just think it's something we just let be. And it's ugly because even in the community and the society, she's your wife. You chose her. As, as, good as, as much as there will be all the beauty pageants and everything, she is the one you chose. That's yes. why you see Mary, you know, even adultery is a sin even before God because you had the a time to choose her or her, but you chose her. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So you committed. Okay. Honor your commitment. Yes. Okay. So, Misana, mi so the day of the market, why, why did you have to beat her because she went to the market? What was wrong with her going to the market? I didn't know where she get the money from. I didn't beat her. But I she's, just she's an adult and she's your wife. You trust her. You should have just asked her. And if she says she explains that she got it from the house girl, the most you could do maybe is ask the house girl. And it's a yes and that's and it. And do you know, Your Honor, she doesn't trust me because when I tell her I'm out in Europe doing my businesses, I'm coming after two weeks, she doesn't agree with that. Oh, well, 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 well. Uh, she well, doesn't well, agree well, with... Order, order, order. Um, uh, 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 Mr. Torres, when I start speaking sometimes, just honor me as... A statesman, and uh, after all, a senior statesman. Uh, I'm that's sorry, why you had me at a point to call you my son, because I believe my age also needs some respect. I'm sorry, so, sir. why would she trust a man who, at a point, I had a talk of you, have you bringing a girlfriend to the to your matrimonial home? Why would you? Why would she trust such a man? Mm. Not once, not twice, not different. Stop pretending. No wonder you came here telling us all about your handsomeness and everything, yeah. Gulu, your it's good a looks. Ijana, Ujana ni Moshi, Itaisha, Yosura Itasag, Utahindo Aban, Jensia Tupac. I thought I also went through the same. Yes. Mm. You, mm. you fail to see the future. 
Nowadays, maybe, maybe you need yeah. to sit with an old man. If your father is alive, to go to ask me for some wisdom. Akwambie. Na ujana unakulanga, uze unakulanga ujana. So all the things you are talking, you're doing and saying will get back to you. Yeah. All the mistreatment. Anyway, uh, Misana, yes, uh, market Imesha, tell me something else. I want to take out and list everything so we can see where we are getting. This man here has reduced me to nothing. I don't even share a room with him. He comes with his uh, so-called concubines, sometimes three at a go, huh. two. And now when they do their dirty things, I'm the maid in the house. I'm the one to wash, even as the worker, the maid servant, not to wash them. I'm the one to wash them. Is that humiliation I'm enough? That is humiliation. Mr. Torres, don't pull a face if you know that's what you do. That is what you do. She's lying. And if I complain, I'm beaten up with even the so-called concubines. Because they have authority under my own home. If I tell you I want to dissolve this Hannah, marriage, I'm tired. Mr. Torres, is that I'm how disrespectful you are to your wife? You come with girlfriends to your house, you yes. do whatever you do, and then she's beaten by will. the girlfriends. Leo, ni Leo. <laughs> Mr. Torres, I, I'm, I'm expecting you to defend yourself because that is... She's that lying. Is that is the truth. She's lying. Who's lying now? Oh, no, 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 no. He's lying. He's I'm just I'm protecting I'm himself. Hmm? Your Honor, I'm saying the truth, and that is why I, I wish you had a witness here. or you had a... I'm a uh, businessman. I will never do that. Why? Businessmen don't have hands to beat their wife. No. Yeah. I'll never bring ladies in my house, like, and I have a wife. Why? Oh, so you go... Uh, at least... My businesses will, will just to not... Like, I can't do that. She's lying. I'm not lying. Okay, that, what do you, you want, Hannah? You want my money? Your Honor, that is what why What do you want? He's doing this. He, he made me to sit in the house so that I can't go out there because I'll see all this and his people and protecting that name of yours. Anna, tell oh, the oh, court. Oh, Miss Anna, Miss Anna, Miss Anna. Tell now, the court Now, I'm also trying to see like you're not very truthful. Mm -hmm. Why do you say that he doesn't want you to go out because you'll see all that? Yet you say he brings it right to your face at home. He brings them, but protecting. You see, he's saying he's protecting his so-called name, his so-called businesses, companies, and so oh, forth. You see, so he doesn't, so he want, doesn't to want to be seen outside to be there. Seen outside. So he brings them home. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, now it makes sense. Anna, Anna you, you, you are making behavior. this up. You are honor, that is It's him. okay, you're exposed. It's okay. It's scripted this, right? How? All the, How? All the, all the, all the Mr. Joshua... Order, please. I told you oh, to no, come you, to an uh, end. Uh, Mr. Handsome, wait, wait, wait. Stop I don't it. want I don't want to I don't want to throw you back to the cells. I for no. my time and also I don't want you to start suffering because before we see whether you belong there. So let's not go. Don't I, uh, put it, uh, hold it low. So that one he denies without explanation. So what else? One time your honor he came home. Yes. I had prepared food. I know how to cook. I'm a very good cook. Oh, he even loves blows my dishes. Yeah. And don't tell me you know the tune to your trumpet, that's why you blow it. So, yes, so, 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 yes. So yeah, he I'm came home. Cook. Yes. Found me prepared food. Yes. Served him. Yes. And my son. He took the food, threw it away, locked me in the toilet, and cooked. What were you going to do in the toilet? He pushed me to the toilet. Him. And he locked you? He locked me inside the toilet. What kind of they toilet is this you lock from outside and not inside? I, most of the toilets are not there. He done. had the keys. So oh, he, he had the yes, keys. Yes, so he okay. locked me inside the toilet. Maybe he cooked other uh, food. Maybe he cooked other food. Okay. But he was like, 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 he cooked food. What did he do with the food he had cooked? He threw it away. The dust. <sighs> I had not eaten, my son had not eaten, although he cooked the food and ate with the, the son. Yes. But he locked me in the toilet. But why had you eaten yourself? No. You had not eaten? So I had to sleep and... Why didn't you, why didn't you eat the food they, they, they had cooked? After eating, he threw the remaining. He threw? Yeah, that is in the dust. Mm. He's so arrogant. This Mr. man you see here is Mr. very arrogant. Mr. you explain to that? I was trying to be wise. What? I was trying to be wise. Wisdom, really. Oh. She started shouting at me. <clears throat> yes. Immediately I was entering the gate. Okay. In the morning while I was going to, to, to work, she was abusing me with each and every word. She mentioned it. I was coming home. She has prepared food. She herself has not eaten. And I was Who does that? I was playing safe. 
hata kama ni wewe of course yeye yeah. hata kama ni mzana mm. yes, is that what happened you know sometimes you get mad with all these concubines okay coming mad. in and out so i was angry but me preparing food is like telling him sorry because he is not even found at home so i cooked food he threw it away thinking i'm going to kill him i can't kill the father of my son do you know that oh so your fear was that you might be poisoned oh yeah but but why would you tell him to serve but himself and he's your husband and he's come from work i have served the food he took the food and threw away and you had the you had the, you have that fear or that shouting you, at me while i'm entering but the gate uh, but the, i think poisoning you is abusing me is, while is going to work much. abusing me while going to work shouting at me while i'm just entering the gate Ms. Your Ms. Honor, Ms. i was begging she has him. not eaten herself oh. i can't Here's the food him. I was playing safe. Your Honor, I can't kill the father to my son. I'll never do that. But you that. see, he has his own fears too. That one, uh, that one, maybe he has his own fears. But instead of uh, disposing the food in such a rude manner, maybe you could have just cooked your own thing and let her eat what she had cooked. What of my kid? You tell her, don't you? Yes. Your Honor, yes. Okay, I was playing safe. Well, you should have played for yourself. You mm. should have just held it to yourself, not, uh, not. Uh, extend it to the to that uh, trick it to that extent you should have let her eat her food if it's poisoned the kufe na watoto wake if it is eating angekula kitambo why maybe she was try, just trying to be romantic she wanted yes. to share a meal with you of course after abusing Where me after shouting at maybe me it was while a i'm coming meal. in maybe it was a make up meal she wanted to make up with you and okay, uh, just it was a, maybe she was trying to kill me also oh well that, well 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 let's not debate on yes. that no, 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 no. it's okay you accept you poured away food it's okay uh, anything else madam your honor if he thinks like that mm. and there was a time i was called he was lying on the road very drunk even unable to drive i went there took him to hospital he was hospitalized why why, why? because he was drunk I, i think he was sick but he was drunk too he was both then he was he was oh, well well you are thinking you are both you have to tell me somebody called me yes i think he's, they scrolled their, his phone and found my number yes. saved hana wife oh hana wife <laughs> yes oh he's not he's okay so he still acknowledges you as a wife yes Even so that person called me yes. i went there he had parked the car mm. and now i had to take him to hospital nikamuguza you are hona i took care of him when he was well he brought concubines in the house what you are making this up why you why why you not sick why you not sick tell the tell the owner tell your owner if you are not sick mm. you were sick hospitalized not only sick hospitalized for days mhm in all honesty mr tauras why would you treat your wife who is they already shown a lot of care When you were in hospital she took care of you she stayed with you what would you do sir there must be a reason i don't think you're just an animal like that i think good looking people have good manners and good heart too okay okay so oh, kindly just explain to this court without fear why would you be so much of an animal towards a good lady who loves you and takes care of you the mother of your child what's going on No fear just just explain whatever are you in a yes. cult is there uh, what's going on let's the just truth. understand the truth. Anna Anna lost her parents and her so uncles. are you mistreating her because she's an orphan and she has nobody no, 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 to no, take no. her to to defend her Anna you know your uncle Mr Dominic yes who is this Dominic now Dominic His is my uncle, uncle your honor is your uncle yes and what does the uncle have to do with her dominic is a businessman very rich okay he took everything after hannah's father after the death or oh, your father passed on my both my parents passed on oh and sorry about that mr dominic killed all the other uncles of yours what Mr. Donin Uncle Dominic oh, No oh, wait a minute okay. And you have an uncle called Dominic Yes your honor And your parents passed on Yes your honor And he took things from you You see when my parents passed on Dominic my uncles there are four Dominic four. is one of them 
So they took all the properties and they planned to kill me. So I ran away. I heard that from my cousin Stacy. My cousin told me they were planning to, on how to poison me so that they could take the wealth of my, my parents. My parents were very rich. They had goats, okay, okay, cows, okay. and all that. Yeah, they were, they were rich. very uh -huh. rich. So they Just were planning to snappy. kill me. We wasted a lot of time. That time I so that I car. left. Yes. So I left. I ran away from home. Yeah. And that is when we met with Mr. Tarus. And we got married. Since then, I've never talked to my uncles. Ever. I'm and wondering even now, he's talking to them and I don't know. Mr. Dominic, I met him and he gave, he's the one who employed me and showed me how to do business. Yes. And he has all the, we call superpower, mm -hmm. security. Mm -hmm. you, can't, you can't mess up with him. And what does he have to do with the, so your mistreatment of your wife? He knew I'm married to Hannah. Yes. I don't know how he came to know about that, but now he told me, I want to use you to kill her. To what? kill Anna. Mr. Dominic instructed you that. Oh, exactly. Jesus. Okay. Before we continue with this case, kindly, I need to have this Mr. Dominic arrested. I'm going to sign the arrest warrant okay, okay. urgently yeah. as a matter of urgency. And uh, I want to see Mr. Dominic in this court next time. Okay, Honorable Judge. Okay. 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 And I mean, I don't want to do man, you. Yes, yes, Honorable Judge. Until next time. All, all rise.